Now, yo, real quick, uh, I got two more questions. We're going to get out of here because the high is a bitch. Um, it will battle. A um, lot, of, lot of talks on the internet, man. I say, rum did he lost, man. I'm going to keep it 100, man. Um, uh, let, let, let's talk about, you know, they said his third round. Uh, he did that's the interview. round I gave him. Okay. So you give yourself one and two? Mm-hmm. I like it. I wasn't there, but I, I can't wait to see it on cam. But yeah. It's let's definitely talk about debatable. It's it definitely debatable. You feel me? My nigga was in there cooking. You feel me? And that's not because I'm homie now. You feel me? It was a nigga in there. He was, he was barking. You feel me? I was barking back. You feel me? I just felt like I landed more. He went second. So when you go second and you rebuttals, when you match or come close to what the the nigga did first, it's, it it automatically is gonna feel like you won because that's the last impression you got. You feel me? I feel like when you watch it back on cam, like I landed a little bit more in that first and second. Oh, I, I took that second clearly. He took the uh, third clearly, and I feel like the first I edged it. Word um, the, the, his third round though, did he actually interview you? Is is that what happened? No 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 no. He just yeah, he did like a, a confrontation type shit and mm. did it to the crowd, like asked questions and he answered like three questions and shit and freestyle to the fans and shit. It was pretty dope. I ain't gonna lie. Fire. Yeah yeah. Hey yo um, mo- last question though um, yo, can you give me like like, like give me a process on how Rum Nitty writes his bars. Like, like what, like, is there something that you do specifically every time? Like, not without giving away yeah, too many secrets. Shit, damn. But, I mean, uh, yeah, this is, I do. I do got a couple things that I do. Uh, I don't want to give away too much shit. Uh, my first thing I want to say to a motherfucker is stay away from these old ass references, my nigga. Find new references, not current events either, because they too known. Like, find new references that you know that's known that just haven't been touched on yet, pause, you feel me? And that's what I look for, I look for just new references, you feel me, like, John John Adon, I don't think my nigga be stealing, he's just the king of old references. <laughs> Clips is the king of old references. Niggas is still doing, how, how I mean, uh, uh, full house bars and shit. I will never in my life, and I have never in my life did a full house bar, because it's, it's, it's the, the reference is too old. Now, if you can find something in a, like, I did a Friday movie reference, but I did shit that I know a motherfucker ain't say, you feel me? So if you if you, if you you slick enough to do that, then, you know, like, I did the Pulp Fiction shit. That's an old-ass reference, but I know nobody didn't say Mark. You ain't mean to Mark out shit, you feel me? Just, yeah. Just stay away from old references, niggas. <laughs> Facts that. Well, yo. Well, yo, for everybody out here, man, that they supporting, man, Rum Nitty through this journey, man, and... Are you gonna continuously be that that number one dude in battle rap, right, man? What's up, man? Anybody wanna call that's out? That's why that's what we doing it mm. for, right? That's why we battling to be the not, top nigga. You feel a- me? So anybody wanna call out real quick, man? Why this the biggest everybody, movie? Everybody, this the biggest. Everybody movie dies. Mm. You know what I mean? All you niggas died, nigga. It is not no Pacific name, right? You not just a Pacific nigga. I want battle. You just gotta die on my journey to the top, nigga. <laughs> Fuck all you niggas, nigga. Homie shit, fourth shit, nigga. You already.